I wanted to tell some funny stories that happened to me in college regarding ASMR or for the Canadians out there. University. 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 So, basically, I was caught red-handed with ASMR on my YouTube homepage. It was an interesting experience and yeah, I, I thought it was quite funny and I wanted to tell this story. So I was on a break during class. You know those four hour classes when you finally get a 10 minute break, it feels like the best feeling in the world when you finally get to stretch your legs or get a snack or even get the most prized possession coffee <laughs> when you finally were let out of class for those 10 minutes or if you wanted you could stay and stay in class and catch up on things Everyone made a beeline to the coffee shop or the coffee station. It was, <laughs> it was like the Hunger Games. It was insane. That day I chose to actually stay in because I needed to catch up on a few things. And a group of my acquaintances actually came up to me. And they asked me to pull up a video on YouTube.com, our favorite website. <laughs> so two of the acquaintances got distracted and the main person watched the video in its entirety. But you know with YouTube on the right side it shows you your recommendations like stuff related to the video you just watched it really depends so on <laughs> the right side of my youtube recommendations were asmr i was extremely extremely deep into the asmr scene at that time because I was trying to figure out what kind of content I wanted to make the acquaintance that watched the full video. Let's call him James. James, after he watched the video and I watched the video, basically said, do you watch that? I noticed my recommended and Let me tell you, I snapped my head back at him <laughs> and said, yeah, I, I kind of blacked out in that moment because <laughs> like it just dawned on me, oh, he knows that I watch <laughs> ASMR and granted at that time. Um, ASMR was, I guess, still being normalized. It's, it's a whole thing. It goes deep. I'm not going to go deep into it now, but basically it was around a time when it was being normalized because a lot of people didn't really know what it was or they thought it was weird because they didn't understand it, right? And yeah, when he <laughs> he asked me that question, I kind of blacked out because I never really told anyone that I watch ASMR because the topic never really came up. So <laughs> the fact that an acquaintance from 
college knew that I watched ASMR was just so funny to me. He said okay and basically alluded to the fact that it was a bit strange. I didn't make any I mean I guess that could have been my opportunity to talk to him I didn't do it and I just said yeah I do and I guess that kind of shocked James as well because (laughs) I was just so you know outright about it (laughs) and yeah all I could think that semester every time (laughs) James and I interacted with one another throughout the semester was oh he knows that I watch ASMR (laughs) it it was just really funny (laughs) oh that was a train (laughs) wow (laughs) this train is very loud (laughs) I actually played ASMR for my friend once, but actually one of those uh, channels where it's a bit ambiguous. You wouldn't know unless you were a veteran. Let me know if you have any experiences with this as well. Like, I wonder if anyone has caught you red-handed um, with a ASMR on your YouTube or has actually like caught you listening to ASMR. And also like and subscribe. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun telling you the story. And I hope to see you in my next video.